welcome to Kentucky Brew Reviews. I'm Domingo. I'm Radar. And I'm Squash. And today we have the new wave in vodka. The new wave in vodka technology. Not bottle technology, though, because this bottle is not round. Can um, you see it from the bottom if you hold it up to the camera? No, nah, nah, you can't round. tell. It's like two lobes. Anyways, yeah. um, <laughs> this is just vodka flavored vodka. It is triple wave filtered and 40... 40% alcohol by volume. What is wave filtering? Uh, I don't know what wave filtering yeah. is, but White Claw had to no. have like come up with just a that. new filter type. <laughs> it's it's just the exact same thing. They're just calling it something different. Probably because they have a wave for the. Allow oh, me yeah. to uh, to pour for you, gentlemen. Mmm, vodka. You gotta love vodka. just straight normal vodka. I mean, I do, but it has its place. I feel like it has its place. I'm a big Wheatley's vodka fan, to be honest. It's like standard. So the S or Tito's for me. All right. So uh, there are other flavors. There's like four other oh, flavors, no. but this one is just vodka flavored vodka. This is just they're basic. And it was seventeen dollars. So this is pretty expensive vodka flavored vodka. Oh, Why yes. does it have a plastic smell, but it's in a glass bottle? Mm -hmm. That that worries me. Uh, I'm just gonna put this back on here because I don't think we need any more of this. No, it's like nail polish and yeah. um, that, that's awesome. ammonia. That, that's pretty common in vodka. Nail though, polish nail and polish. ammonia, though. <laughs> it, it really does. It smells like nail polish remover for sure. Uh, yeah. like the blue so stuff. We're about to drink like acid. <laughs> does not smell like seventeen dollar vodka. No, this smells like it smells like Burnett. Smells like like eight dollar vodka. Yeah, mm. great. This is like, uh, what's the shit that we clean the, oh, what's the stuff that we clean the, <laughs> that we clean the bar with? Taka. This is taka. like taka level. Is what it Have a like. taste of it. It's really, it, there's not a lot there. It's pretty mellow. I thought you just downed that whole thing. I like, could've. Honestly, it's shouldn't. smooth. Yeah. It's really it's smooth. Got like a, just don't sniff it. For a 40, for a 40%, it does go down really smooth. No, like, there's not a lot of burn that's just there. straight water and you get a tiny bit, but not even there's alcohol. Like, there's like a little, there's, tell a little, there's alcohol in it. There's a little sweetness to it. Mm -hmm. Just a little bit. While it's in your mouth, you don't really get the alcohol burn. You swallow it, then yeah. you get the alcohol burn. Mm -hmm. Yep. Which is honestly pretty good for vodka. Mm -hmm. Um, it definitely, it, but is it, it worth tastes, 17? Though? I feel like it tastes 17. more like a $17 vodka than it smells. Yeah. Yeah. True. Don't smell it. it Just don't sniff it. Seventeen dollars, I don't know, but you can tell that it's filtered pretty well. Mm. It's definitely clean. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say that this is better than uh, another vodka in the same category, in the same like price range. Sky vodka. Yeah, Sky is overpriced. It's yeah. overrated. This is definitely better than Sky vodka. I would say, I would say, you think this is better than New Amsterdam? Not, not if you take prices. I think it's, I think it's yeah. kind of on the same level, fighting it out with New Amsterdam. That's what I'm thinking. Like in between New Amsterdam and Svedka. Yeah, but okay. it's double the price. Yeah, true. Mm, yeah. I mean, Svedka's not. You're, you're paying for what's on the label Svedka's here. Like let's be honest. Nine ninety nine. You're, you're yeah. paying for the White Claw label. I don't really yeah. get, I don't really get the, the now, fifths of it. The, the flavor. The flavored ones might make sense for them to be that price because they're probably using whatever flavor mm -hmm. they're using in yes, the White Claws. The White Claws are already expensive. Yeah. So. And people are like, oh, this is going to be like White Claw, but I can get trashed faster. Exactly. Way faster. Yeah. But so, this is just 40% alcohol flavor do it to you. Yeah, so the flavored ones, I get, yeah, I can definitely see Have them being more expensive. Have you seen about this thing that the, the Borg that these Gen Z people are making? The what? It's called Borg. Take a... You take a gallon of water, right? You pour it like halfway out. Put vodka in it and then like squirt some Mio in it and shake it up and take it to tailgate. Why, Why water? Is it called Borg? I don't know. Why water? You will be assimilated. Water and Mio, is this just like to lose weight? Like, is that just like their diet drink? Water, vodka, know. and Mio. So they're bringing it down to like 15%. Why adding their own flavor. So why wouldn't you yeah. just squirt? Mio directly into the vodka and take shots of it. I feel like that's yeah. the way to go. That, that would be a much better way. option. Yeah. 
I, I mean, I guess you're at least you're hydrating while you're dehydrating. Yeah, but then you're just not really doing much. Unless it's going to take you longer to get that buzz. And why, why wouldn't you just get a buzz and then if you want some water, drink some water? Yeah, I don't know. I don't, it's a weird phenomenon. I guess it's cheap. I mean, look, how often do it's you a, smell vodka? It's than like drinking beer all day. Yeah. Like when you're just sitting in your house, you're drinking vodka. You've got your you've got your your rocks glass or whatever, and you're just drinking vodka straight. How often do you stop to smell it? Hardly ever. That's that same same with me. Yeah. I, I mean, I might accidentally catch a whiff. I, I don't I don't really yeah. sit and smell the vodka. Right. I might do that with like bourbon. I right. do do that with bourbon. True. I'll yeah. admit. I, I don't I don't drink vodka straight often. Like hardly ever, unless it's a shot or something. I think as a straight vodka, this is actually pretty good. I'm gonna give it like a seven. Taking price into consideration. Oh uh, yeah. Uh, price does hurt. I'm gonna yeah. leave it at a seven. Okay. Really? I am gonna leave it at a seven. Uh, just because, uh, well, just no, no specific vodka. reason. Way cheaper. Yeah, that's got to be <laughs> down at like the, what, 10? I mean, you're all, you're bordering on Tito's price. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like, and that's know. just water. Tito's but... has, Tito's has a, has a, a, a background flavor that I'm not I think, really? excited I about. Just, I think yeah. it's the wheat, probably. It could be. I, say, I prefer... Vodka's they're made with rye. That's why like I'm super about Sobieski, but in a pinch I'll get Tito's. Mm. Like, and if I'm like really trying to be cheap, no Amsterdam. Like, what about what about you? What's your score? Uh, for? I give it like a five, just because of the price. Okay. Like, yeah, it's it's fine and it's doable. There's no alcohol burn. It's all right, but it's just, it's double the price it needs to be. If you need to have like, a refrigerator that's full of only. Only this kind of product, only only white claws. Right. If you're like, yeah, that's ingrained you're into for the, the white brand. claw ecosystem, as if you were an Apple consumer. <laughs> that's the only reason it's that expensive is you're paying for the brand. Yeah. You're there's playing, a lot of you're playing to flex on other white girls. I mean, come on, let's, let's yeah. be honest. I mean, that's why that's why I mean, you it's buy. Ba that's basically the whole marketing real. strategy of Grey Goose, though. Like, yeah, the the giant bottle. Or yeah, it's like it's it's absolutely. Goose, man. It's yeah. goose. Take take it's marketing. It it does it. It works. It does its job. It's pretty good. It's pretty clean, but it's definitely overpriced. So I'm going with a six. Okay. I think that's fair. Oh, six. Would you recommend it? There's better stuff for cheaper. I'd or say at least on the same level. If you can get this for a re for a reasonable price, say uh, when nobody buys them 12, in like $13? three months, they're at tr uh, they're at uh, Jungle Gems for like six dollars. Oh, then oh, you buy it. Absolutely. Yeah. But people yes. are gonna buy this, so. Someone's gonna bring this to a party and just try some of theirs because you don't need to buy it yourself. People yeah, will buy yeah, it. There you go. That, that's that's accurate. Yeah. Now we have to mix this. What are we mixing? And with? of course, <laughs> we're gonna bring out the old trusty standby for vodkas. Uh, we've got seltzer. We've got sparkling water. sparkling seltzer that is strawberry flavored. Mmm, strawberry. Sparkling water. That is not very Why do I feel like we're just? So it's just gonna be water. Why do I feel it's like we're making carbonation away? We're making a. Uh, we are making we're a just making we are making, making a white, a white claw. claw. We are <laughs> making a white claw. We're making a strawberry white claw right now. I mean, that's what I do though. Like, I'll get like vodka and like pour Lacroix in it. Yeah, and like it's cheaper and tastes. Okay, so it was the strawberry stuff that's like marbling in the in the drink. Look at it. It's I doing mean, it again. It wasn't. Not, it wasn't the last. I'm drink. not. Super it wasn't surprised. just the tamarind vodka. I no, guess. it was just this. Huh, that, I mean. Does it have artificial sweeteners in it already? Oh yeah, man. This 100%. is this is ninety nine cents. It's artificial everything. Well, Even the water is. Yeah, they, I'm pretty sure they grew the water in a lab or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it has sucralose. Yeah, it has Splenda in it. Ooh, that's a smell. It's just super strong strawberry smell. Um, like fake strawberry smell. Does it does it strike anyone else odd that the strawberry is that strong? I told you, bro. Does look it smell at, like that in the look, bottle. It's. No, it doesn't it smell it. the strawberry? Smell it. I mean, it smells, but not that strong. No. How does it increase the level of strawberry as we watered it down with vodka? <laughs> smell, smell that. Yeah, you get closer to it, you can smell it pretty strong. Is it just because of the level? Yeah, I think that there's, there's just a bunch of air. There's an air gap there. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, I got it. It's you. just the drink. Okay. I was right. like, why? How does that work? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like how I will say it did cover it up the weird zero smell. To 10 calories. I don't believe the zero because that math does not add up. If yeah. one serving was zero calories, how is the entire thing 10 calories? It's it's magic, and you don't need to worry about <laughs> it. Yeah. 
Um, I think it looks wine, exactly maybe. the same now as it did before. Yeah. Yeah. It's just it just looks like vodka. I will say it got rid of most of the off flavor of the vodka. You still get like a little bit of alcohol scent, but that's about it. See, that's that's exactly what this is for. Yep. You're just making your own. You get yourself the 99 oh. cent water. You know what that tastes like? Mm. Like in the por try this with the portions that I did. Mm, okay. You ready? You ready for this? You ready for this? Vodka squeeze. Oh, the the freezer. Accurate, the, like the accurate. No, the the little the those company little, that loves those us little for bags. no reason and sends us oh, the yeah, complete yeah. sides of vodka. I still have some I of those actually. Yeah. They sell them. I remember the stores by my house, and I, was I, like, I yeah. didn't know they were even still a company. I saw them at the <laughs> liquor store and I grabbed some because they're great. Yeah, I'm like, a big fans. Yeah. Anyway, the orange ones. Were um, good. that's fantastic. Yeah, it's pretty good. But is it seventeen dollars good when you can do you, you can accomplish the exact same thing with another vodka? Yeah, I am still gonna stick to uh, to new or not new uh, Svedka. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm gonna stay a Svedka household. I mean, because you could, yeah, because you can honestly go lower if you're mixing mm -hmm. spark yeah. quality. So, um, but what do I want to give this? That's a great question. One that I am waiting for the answer to. Like a five, and a, <laughs> five and a half mixed, I guess. Man, like, you love it. Point a half a point. Yeah. Okay. I'm saying just because I can do it for cheaper, better. You know what I mean? I'm so I don't see the point. Exactly. That's why I'm gonna keep it right at six. I'm like, it's it's exactly the same as it was because in my mind, vodka is almost always a mixer. Mm. Mm. So I mean, it does. It just does what vodka do. You know what I mean? <laughs> that's what it's what it do. I'm gonna keep it at the same score. Uh, the same score also. Yeah. I'm gonna give this a seven, but for a different reason. I could honestly drink this straight or as a mixer. That's yeah. true. That is true. I think I think it I think it works just fine as a straight vodka, which I, is rare. You don't get that a whole lot but in, the, all, in the like sub twenty dollar category. All that really means is it's well filtered. Mm -hmm. That's true. It's, it's wave filtered. Right, whatever the waves whatever. are. Whatever, yeah. Uh, it is weird if you like put the bottle in your hand and turn it. You don't can ask feel why we like do this. there are two lobes. There's this side and there's this side. And, and they like, like they like meet all in like the middle. <laughs> we have a couple more of the other flavors. There's four total flavors of these. Um, we need to check the shape of the other bottles. Well, we've come across several bottles that are like exactly the same, just with different labels. I get the feeling they're all coming from the same so different, bottle maker, yeah, yeah. production company. <laughs> they're, their harnesses are just a little bit off. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm gonna say. It, especially if you already enjoy white claws and you're comfortable with dropping like. Five extra dollars, yeah. More like go ahead and get that. More like like nine extra dollars. Just get, just get new Amsterdam of yeah. Svetka. Yeah, that, uh, yeah, that that would be my go-to. I I'm not planning on buying would, any more of this. Unless you're just a brand whore. If you have yeah, uh, exactly. if you have well, hitched I mean, your wagon to am, this brand so when it comes to shoes, yeah, I'm a brand you're whore. very Nike man. But I I wouldn't recommend it. I wouldn't go out. You can get stuff that's just as good for a less price. Mm -hmm. I would have a really hard time telling someone that they should buy this unless they were super duper into the White Claw like label. There's a lot of people. Uh, anyways, if you'd like to see anything else, leave a comment down below. I'm Radar. And I'm Squash. And I'm Domingo. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. Are you checking your watch? You got somewhere to be? <laughs>